Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name's Anissa and don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and ring the bell. Everything I will link to will be linked to down below in the description and let's get right into the video. So I will be using the um, artist collection by iMethod Beauty. That's their social media right there. Um, and it is just at iMethod Beauty for pretty much all of them. And you can find this brand on Amazon. They sent this to me um, to test it out and do a review on it if I liked it and I did like it and this is not sponsored even listen to me I literally tested that, tested this out three times I will be using this color today I'm going through all the colors there are six in total and like I said this is found on Amazon so it will be a link left in the description to an Amazon link and I really do enjoy these colors. I have done the first time, well, the first day I got it, I did like a little bit of um, testing it on my bare nails. Then I did an, an entire set on it over acrylic. This is over poly gel right now, and I'm using a Beatles color. Um, this is a short, cute video, so I'm gonna go ahead and get through it. But this is um, just a nude from like a Beatles kit. I'll leak, leave it in the description as well. Um, Yes, I, I had like a whole nude concoction, then I found this, and this is the exact same as a little nude concoction. So, if you're looking for gel polish nudes, that's a great kit. Um, they do have a nude in here as well, but I already used it, so I wanted to use something different. And I'm gonna tell you guys my little criteria. Um, how full coverage is it, is it? How good are your instructions? And does it work for nail art? Because not all gel polish does. And on the solid nails, this did really well. Um, I forgot to buff these nails, so I really wanted to put it to the test um, to see what it could really do over some like bumpy nails because I filed these and everything. But you want to cure for 60 to 120 seconds is what they recommend. Their instructions are very, very good. Um, I didn't show it to you in this video because I showed it in the other one that's coming up, which I reviewed first, um, which I recorded first, I should say. And this was my... Like I said, this is my first time testing this brand out, period, like they sent this to me. Um, but I've done, I've tested this polish multiple times. Um, one coat is for sheer coverage. Two coats is for um, medium to full, pretty much full, depending on how thick you apply it. Like even if it's pretty thin, it'll work for you. Obviously, if you clear the brush off all the way, it'll still be very sheer on like your second coat. And then for three coats, we'll give you like full coverage. Again, don't wipe your brush off too much, but at the same time, if you put too much gel on, it's not gonna cure properly and it's just gonna wrinkle. Um, and for my nail art, I'm gonna be doing some fringes. So something very simple and very practical that everyone would do. Um, well, everyone probably will do if you're doing it this way. If you like to do it with gel polish. So I'm using a Beatles brush right here that will also be linked down the in the description it's from uh, Amazon as well and here I am I was just figuring out where to do my line and I just went ahead and did it off camera I was out of frame for most of this, this is a McCart cleanup brush and I'm using alcohol as my cleanup solution and I'm just cleaning up that line you kind of want to cure this because you can see right there how the color is a little bit um, patchy that's because it's like way too thin but of course I will be doing two coats um, and I was curing this um, in between for 30 seconds because obviously you don't want it to take it, want it to take a really long time. And you can see how easy it is for me to draw the French here. And all I have to do is, I barely even clean this one up to be honest with you. But I noticed if you have it sitting there for like a little while, not really a little while, but like a couple seconds while you're doing your other nail, it will spread out and get a little bit splotchy. So you just kind of want to cure it. Um, it'll be solved in your second coat, but you want to cure it um pretty much after you're done if you don't you don't have to but also i was gonna say something um i really enjoy the colors they that comes in the uh, artist collection they have like three other kits and one of them comes with all these colors plus some extra ones and then gel top coat base coat well shiny top coat matte top coat and um, and a base coat is what I'm forgetting. But this does clean up pretty easily. I don't recommend you cure this for 30 seconds at a time because it did 
um, kind of eat away my line when I was using alcohol to clean it, to sharpen it up, even though I had cured the first layer and did a second layer on top to go back and clean it up. It was eating away my second layer, so my smile line was moving a little bit. So just cure it for a full 60 seconds. I was really just testing it here um, because the other time I did it, I cured it for 60 seconds at a time and I was using the dark blue color that comes in here and it worked fine for me when I was cured for 60 seconds. So I'm gonna try it for 30 because I do tend to cure my um, nail art for 30. And sometimes when I'm doing my full colors for like 30 seconds of a time, at a time if I'm doing it like on an enhancement like this, but if I'm doing it on a press on, I do a full 60 seconds. So I used um, acrylic creameries matte top coat over the nude nails. And then I'm using the acrylic creamery diamond top coat over the entire set. Um, they did not send me a top coat or base coat or a matte top coat or anything like that. So I don't know how that formula is or how shiny it is or how long it lasts. But I do know that this polish is really good. I really enjoy it. I like the consistency of it. It's creamy, but it's not to the point of where... And it's pigmented, but it's not to the point of where like it's sticking on every single thing you do when you're trying to do nail art. It wipes up pretty easily. Um, so make sure you cure it for a full 60 to 120 seconds. Um, three coats to two coats if you want full coverage. And wipe your sides off so it doesn't get bulky and spread out, but that's with any other gel polish. And I'm using Get No 32 Cuticle Oil. I hope you guys enjoy this little review. I really like this polish. So don't forget to check out iMethod Beauty's socials. Here's the color I used and here's the rest of the colors in this collection. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this short little video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and ring the bell. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Also, don't forget to check out my socials. They'll be linked down below in the description.